Hey there guys, it's Lee here. Hope you're having a great day. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to use the NVIDIA Solo GPU miner um, to mine Nexus Nero coins. Um, so the first thing that you want to do is open up your Nexus-QT wallet. So that is the actual wallet file there because we're gonna actually be doing solo mining. So the miner mines to directly to your local wallet. So you wanna fire up the Nexus wallet, make sure it's up and fully running. And then just make sure you've got the green tick in the bottom right hand corner. That just means that you're actually fully up to date and um, synchronized. So that's your wallet up and running. Um, then what I'll do is I'll put an actual link in the uh, video description so you can actually download the miner. So it's this GPU mining one CUDA. Um, I'll put a link to that in the description. It's quite a difficult uh, file to uh, find and it wasn't in the original Bitcoin talk thread. Um, I downloaded it from one of the actual uh, Nexus mining pools. So download the file and then you want to uh, right click and extract it. Um, I've already done that. And then we've got this GPU mining folder dash CUDA. So we'll go into there and once again, it's just put it in a subfolder. Uh, so this is it, so you've got lots of DL DLL files in there. You've got the actual SK miner itself, and then you've got a couple of uh, batch files. Um, I'll leave this one in there. This is the one that I just um, used, um, or created and then used. So if I just right click, I'll just show you what's inside. So you've just got a begin, then you've got the SK miner, which is the actual program. Then you've got this IP address and the port number, and that is actually the IP address and port number for our local Nexus wallet. And then if you've just got the loop, basically goes back to the beginning. So we can close that. Now if you just uh, double click on the actual start, you might get a warning to say run this file, um, just like a Windows protection, if that pops up just to confirm it. So it's the SK miner for NVIDIA GPUs by DJM34. Um, and I think he's worked on a few other miners. I'm not sure whether he done the, was it the, um, it's either SG miner or the CC miner. But um, the name is definitely familiar, so this guy's obviously got a bit of experience. Um, and then you can see further down on the actual miner itself, it says that connected to the actual local wallet via the port number. Um, it comes at Coin Shield network, and that's because that's what uh, Nexus was originally called, Coin Shield. And then underneath that, then you've actually got this um, hash rate. So you can see here we're at, um, just over 40,000 hashes per second. Um, for reference, the card that I've got is a GTX uh, 970, and that actually looks uh, like a pretty good hash rate. Um, I tested the AMD miner on, on another machine, and that had two, uh, two ATXs in there, and that was only getting about 50,000 hashes per second, so um, sort of three quarters of the way there, um, just with a single uh, NVIDIA GPU. So that seems to be a good hash rate, but um, like I say, just to let you know for a comparison, that's what I'm getting. Um, and then what you do is you just leave the actual miner running. Um, it's going to give you some various uh, network information uh, when new blocks have been found, etc. That's by the way, that's just a, a new blocks being found on the network, not necessarily you. Um, so then, yeah, you just leave that running, and it's just basically mine into your local wallet. Once you find a block, you will be rewarded directly into your wallet itself. Okay, so hopefully that's been helpful for you guys. Um, if you have any questions or comments, um, don't hesitate to put those in the discussion area below this video. And I'll be sure to get back to you guys. See ya.